In this section, we will be dealing with a variety of electrophilic addition reactions to alkynes, beginning with the electrophilic addition of HBr to 2-butyne. The addition of one equivalent of HBr to 2-butyne is a stereospecific anti-addition reaction and results in the formation of Z2-bromo-2-butene. The addition of a second equivalent of HBr results in the formation of 2,2-dibromobutane as per Markovnikov's rule. Reaction Mechanism Step 1 The polarized HBr adds to the triple bond to give a vinylic carbocation. The bromide ion attacks this carbocation from the opposite side to form Z2-bromo-2-butene. Step 2. The addition of a second equivalent of HBr obeys Markovnikov's addition rules and forms the carbocation A. Br- attacks this carbocation to form 2,2-dibromo-butane. Electrophilic addition of HBr to propyne. The addition of one equivalent of HBr to propyne results in Markovnikov's addition and gives 2-bromopropene as the product. The addition of a second equivalent of HBr would also result in a Markovnikov's addition and give 2,2-dibromopropane. This reaction goes through a carbocation in which the positive charge is on the carbon carrying the Br and therefore more stable due to resonance. Electrophilic addition of HCl to unsymmetrical alkynes Unsymmetrical alkynes like 2-pentane gives a mixture of Z2-chloro-2-pentane and E3-chloro-2-pentane upon the addition of one equivalent of HCl. Upon the addition of a second equivalent of HCl, a mixture of gem dihalides 2,2-dichloropentane and 3,3-dichloropentane or formed molecules having two halogen atoms on the same carbon are called geminal dihalides or gem dihalides. Electrophilic addition of bromine to alkynes. The addition of one equivalent of bromine to two pentane results in anti-addition product trans 2,3-dibromopentane. The reaction goes through a bromonium ion intermediate. The addition of a second equivalent of bromine results in the formation of 2,2,3,3-tetrabromobutane. Electrophilic addition of water to alkynes. Preparation of ketones. Under acid catalysis, 2-butyne adds water across the triple bond to give an enol. Note that the hydrogen adds to one carbon and the hydroxy group to the other carbon. The enol rearranges to a more stable ketone 2-butanone. The enol and ketones are related as tautomers. Tautomers are isomers that are in equilibrium with each other. Depending on the structure of the molecule, either one can predominate. Ketones usually predominate. Even as the double bond in enol is protonated by acid, 
the OH bonding electrons move to make the carbonyl bond. The hydrogen of OH is picked up as a proton by a water molecule. Electrophilic addition of water to alkynes, preparation of ketones. Unsymmetrical alkynes like 2-pentane gives a mixture of enols upon the addition of one equivalent of water. The enols rearrange to give a mixture of ketones 2-butanone and 3-butanone. Mercuric ion catalyzed addition of water to alkynes, preparation of ketones. Acid catalyzed hydration of terminal alkynes like 1-butane is slow. However, this reaction is done efficiently using mercuric sulfate as catalyst in the presence of water and sulfuric acid. 1-butane when treated with water, sulfuric acid and mercuric sulfate, the pi electrons attack the mercuric ion and forms the carbon-mercury bond. Water attacks the other carbon to give a mercuric intermediate. In the presence of acid, it is converted to an enol which rearranges to the ketone to butanone. Hydroboration oxidation of alkynes Preparation of ketones Hydroboration followed by oxidation of alkynes offers another method for the preparation of ketones from alkynes. For example, 2-butane when treated with borane undergoes syn addition to give a vinylic borane. The vinylic borane upon oxidation with hydrogen peroxide in the presence of water and hydroxide gives a vinyl alcohol. The vinyl alcohol which is an enol readily rearranges to the ketone to butanone. Hydroboration oxidation of alkynes, preparation of aldehydes. Terminal alkynes like 1-propyne are more reactive than internal alkynes towards BH3. Additionally, boron can add to either of the carbons if BH3 is used, resulting in mixtures. However, terminal alkynes like 1-propyne when reduced with bulky reducing agent like diciml borane, an alkyl derivative of borane, stereospecific addition takes place. Boron attacks the less crowded carbon, resulting in the formation of a vinylic borane. Further reduction to an alkyl borane is prevented due to steric factors. The vinylic borane can be oxidized with hydrogen peroxide in the presence of water and hydroxide to a vinyl alcohol. The vinyl alcohol rearranges to a more stable aldehyde, propanal. Hydrogenation of alkynes, preparation of cis and trans alkenes. Alkynes can be reduced stereospecifically to either a cis alkene or a trans alkene depending upon the kind of reducing agents used. 2-pentine, when treated with hydrogen and Lindlar catalyst, gives cis-2-pentene, which can be reduced to pentane. When 2-pentine is reacted with lithium in liquid ammonia, it gives trans-2-pentene. Further reduction with hydrogen and platinum leads to pentane.